The Israeli Academy of Film and Television has announced its nominees for the Ofer Awards. These awards will be given out in a ceremony on September 10. None. The nominations include some surprising choices and notable exclusions. One interesting aspect of the nominating process is that films that have not yet been released can still be nominated, sometimes with a delay of months or even years before they reach theaters. Among the nominated films, there is a range of diverse themes. One film, Home, directed by Benny Fredman, tells the story of a young ultra-orthodox man opening a computer store in a Haredi neighborhood, facing opposition from those against technology. Another film, The Vanishing Soldier, by Danny Rosenberg, explores a soldier who escapes from battle in Gaza and returns to Tel Aviv secretly. The Other Widow, by Mayan RYPP centers around a costume designer in a Tel Aviv theater coping with the sudden death of her lover. Running on Sand, by Adar Shafran follows an Eritrean refugee escaping deportation and getting mistaken for a struggling soccer team's new player. Lastly, Seven Blessings, by Ayelet Menahimi tells the story of a bride-to-be with family secrets from a Moroccan background. Notable films that did not make the best picture cut include The Monkey House, A Room of His Own, and America, but their directors received nominations in other categories. The nominees for Best Actor include Sassan Gabe, Jor Karen, Roy Nick, Michael Mashinov, and Ido Teiko. In the Best Actress category, Raymond Amsalem is nominated twice, alongside Susanna Papian, Ashrit Ngadashit, and Dana Ivji. The winner of the Ofer Award for Best Movie becomes Israel's official submission for consideration in the Best International Feature category at the Oscars. Israel has had 10 nominations in this category without a win, and the last nominee was in 2012. It remains to be seen if this year's Ofer winner can break this streak.